six and a half hours of this bracket. But here we go, game one going to PS2. Three, two, one, go! All right, already starting off, uh, Venya at 25, stock ticker at 15 percent. And this is mostly just gonna be a game of each other getting in each other's faces, looking for the confirms, especially with stock ticker. But Venya also is gonna try and get his combo game going here. Nair the jab. Back row. Okay, Venya gonna opt to recover deep. Questionable up smash. I'm trying to catch a landing, but Stotzaker gonna move away from it. The drag down, jab block, and a forward smash. Good combo coming out from Venya. Now Stotzaker just gonna tag him with a dash attack. Another forward tilt coming out from uh, Stocksaker, but he does find the back air, and that really did send Venya flying, and they only managed to do 5% on him. All right. And so right now, um, you're going to be seeing a lot of what... Um, that, see, Venya is going with those landing foilers, which is so big on a character like Wolf, who might not be necessarily the best on punishing it out of shield. So either Wolf has to anticipate and be behind Venya, where he can do like a pivot grab or something. Otherwise, he's just going to have to respect Venya doing that, trying to get the nail into dash attack, but Venya jumping out in time. But now, Stock Ticker has that downloaded, meaning he could, at any given moment, he could mix that up with a dash attack into up air. So right now, he's got the dash attack into up smash. So, so good. Always a good, reliable combo confirm for, uh, mm -hmm. for Greninja. In fact, he knows just how to get it down. Ooh, and uh, Greninja just running around. Getting a oof, that oof. First hit of back here into dash attack. He just knocked him so far off stage with that. Like, Venny is doing like, a great job of just like continuing to apply the pressure onto Stock Taker. Uh, tried to get the tech chase oh, out. Oh, wow. He went bad. He meant went, went mad deep for that back yep. there. <laughs> That's a really, really great commitment from Venya. Just like, he knows when to really turn it up and when to play it back down. With a character like Wolf, you have to be edge guarding him so much. He did a really, really yeah. great job. Oh, uh, what is this? <laughs> we got we got Venya's fan base coming over here smothering him. <laughs> uh, Long Island. Why did Long Island just... Long Island just smothered and the heck out of him. And then just came in. Okay. That's... <laughs> That's fine. That's cool. <laughs> That's cool. Game two, let's go. <laughs> Look at this faded Zero slow down to that. GTN. <laughs> Wait, but it's not even gonna get complete. He just got held up on stream. He just got... He just got left hanging on stream in front of everybody. And I hope he gets embarrassed because of that. But right now, going into game two, we see Venya starting off with a landing neutral and effectively gaining so much stage control against Stocksaker. And I think the Palutena was a phenomenal switch choice here, especially considering that Venya was exploiting how linear Wolf's recovery was. And honestly, Stocksaker didn't want any part of that, and I agree. Yeah, I didn't even know Stocksaker had a Palutena as well. Stocksaker plays Palutena, Wolf, Villager, and Weefit. And we do, okay. Yep. So he's got a good repertoire. So getting a dash attack to, uh, I believe that might have been an attack cancel back here that time around. Ooh, and Stock Ticker getting the, the two frame down tilt, but that unfortunately did not put him into his own back here. And right now he's doing a phenomenal job of keeping up the ledge pressure against Venya, but Venya got a really, really great parry punish in order to regain stage control. Mm -hmm. Gotta catch him with a dash attack. Trying to catch him landing with the up air, but the up tilt at 140 something. Really, really great. And those edge cancel up B's just throwing off Venya's timing, throwing off his momentum, and forcing him to really, really stay on his webby, slimy Greninja feed. Um, <laughs> Get him with the forward air. Yep. Punishing, punishing that there. And I really, really love that double jump bait because the, the reason why Fenio just like burned one of his resources like that by jumping 
was he wanted Stock Siku to go in. He wanted him to recognize that as an approach opportunity, and he punished him for it with the right uh, falling fist. So really, really great uh, baiting for many of those. Well, regardless, right now he has a ledge trap situation, calling out the air dodge with the down smash. Not enough to kill it quite yet. Oh, ledge trap down. Whoa. Hold on. Back throw. Ah, uh, still avoiding almost all of the hits of the auto radical, at least the ones that matter. Uh, right now, Benny is looking for a falling back here. This did not come off stage. Stock taker. Who and He's that is going to be the up throw. Yep. Right now, Benny is sitting at a 78%, and honestly, that's not too far of a deficit considering the fact that if Benny were to just jump on top of him with a falling neutral, who knows how much damage he could deal. Ooh, crossing up his shield with dash attack. Stock Ticker has to know better, knowing that he cannot grab out of shield on that. And there we go, that's a back here. That's almost another one, but amazing DI from Stock Ticker. Short hop down air. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's gonna, he's gonna tag him with that up there. Yep. Now yeah, Stock Ticker in a good position, sitting at 31.8 on his second yep. stock. Right now, that's a neutral a great way to cover so many of the options on platform when you move as giant and disjointed and active for so long. Who even knows all the things that you can do? Regardless, right now, Stock Taker is slowly building up the percent, is what I would say, had Benny not gotten that lovely parry punish. He's gonna follow him after that forward air, but he's not gonna get anything off of it. Back air. Oh, that, <laughs> that, Ooh, that automatic back was set all over the place. Oh, he caught that down air with the up air. And honestly, Greninja does not have quite as many landing options on top of Palutena, considering how dis destroyed her stuff is. But he's able to get that stock off. Right now, 107% Palutena able to armor through it, literally with her shield. Um, oh, he's gonna get it with down tilt. Down tilt no, not enough to not take exactly. it quite yet. Air dodging that explosive uh, flame. All right now, Venio breaking his tumble with the up air and the dash attack. He did, he died into it. Mm. Really, really unfortunate. Yeah, very unfortunate. Making it one Venio. one, and even closer to another potential best out of five. Mm -hmm, indeed. <laughs> Possibly another game five in this, but uh, that's only it's only game two. Only tied up here at game two, going to game three. You spiked with Greninja back here more times than I'd like to. Wow. <laughs> yep. That's actually, yeah, that is actually evil. <laughs> okay, right now, regardless, we see Vanya jumping on with the aggression with a nail on the shield, exploiting the fact that, of course, almost everything Greninja can do is safe. But Stock Ticker retorting with a 54% of his own, not even sure how that came about. Is did so much damage so quickly. Right now, both of these players are just dancing around each other, trying to get something started. Venya using the shuriken as an interrupt tool, but of course, that clanking with the forward air. Forward air, dash attack. Ooh, unable to punish the landing aerial on his shield, and Stock Ticker now back carrying him off the stage. Really, really convincingly, this is so scary for Venya, but he is able to reassert stage control. Is what I would say had he not been pushed to the outer platform of Town City. I got a dash attack in there. Nope. Back here. Oh, he's not gonna get him with that down tilt. But the forwarder was beautifully spaced, just pushing him out, trying to two frame him with forwarder, but that not connecting. He was a little bit too low for it. Ah, oh, he got the right idea too. He could have capitalized a little bit more with F Smash, but that's fine. You knock him off stage, dealt a little bit of damage, and that is what matters. Oh, that's what happens when you go all the way to the top yep. blast zone. Then he's, he's up there, he's looking for it. You know what he's looking for. He can kill you so early with that kind of thing. Not, you know, much less to say 130 something. But he said down tilt yep. into F tilt. Beautiful spacing to be able to connect that. Oh, he's gonna eat up that, uh, eat up that explosive flame, but that high ceiling is gonna prevent him from, from, uh, from uh, flying away. That's it, that's gonna be the back throw, but that's still not enough to take it, considering they are at center stage, and not oh, usually close to get up, though, into that explosive flame. Benio was a little bit too antsy, he had to slow it down just a little bit. 
That's going to be an up air. Ooh, setting up a tech chase. But then uh, Stock Seeker teching out was able to successfully be subverted. Oh, I thought I was going to be able to do that again. But um, excellent DI from Stock Seeker. That was oh. a random footstool. I heard the noise into a down air. Really beautiful stuff from Venia. Still yeah. being able to execute something like that. It's amazing how he was able to react to that. Oh, that was just bad DI from Stock Taker. Definitely not expected to get hit by that side beat. And right now, Venia sitting at 64%. A very considerable lead against Stock Taker right now. He's now running around, hoping to scoop him up with that pivot grab. But of course, he's getting punished Ooh. for it. I think that was, I thought that was almost it, but that nail. Oh man, that was an excellent response. All right, excellent response from Stock Taker, and now making this one pretty even. Here we go with the aerial strings. Really great falling back, but unfortunately, Stock Taker able to low profile with the defensive option immediately afterwards. Dash attack confirming into the floater like that. Drag down up air, that chase. He was trying to uh, reach a missed tech with a jab lock, but not getting it, unfortunately. Oh. Gonna get that down to the up smash, ain't gonna now, kill just Yes, he's struggling to get back onto stage. He has to find a way to land. And yeah. that forward air, yeah. Especially when you are when you're mm -hmm. up there on that top platform. Yep. And things are heating up. You know, game. This is gonna be the game where he looks stock taker finds himself fighting and losers against the winner of John and Jen. Or we're gonna see a potential game five if uh, stock taker were to take this. Sticking with the Palutena choice in Venya. Sticking with you know Greninja, his character of choice, of course. It's tried and true, even though he does have a fox. But yep. Only, you'd only see him like pull it out and pull sometimes. Regardless, opting to go right back to PS2. Both of these characters get so much mileage off of the platform extensions here. Ooh, really, really great dash attack right now. Ah, unable to connect the second air. Fantastic up tilt to anti air stock taker, able to convert that into quite another up air. I love the fact that he went for the jab there instead of another move because it's just so non committal, and he was able to react to the fact that he didn't connect it. So he went for some other additional option coverage. A really, really smart mix up game for Benio. Ooh. Oh, he tried to watch where he was going to land on that and Then one. he had to walk up just a little bit, and then he would have been able to connect the up F smash. But the back is landing back here, almost getting the win box on Stock Taker, which would have surely spelled his doom. And right there, that's the win yeah. box and the down smash. Yep. Stock Taker shaking his head, knowing exactly what happened there. He shouldn't have inputted that up B. Like that. Really, really great. Oh my god. That up B was angled perfectly to go under the down tilt. And Stock Taker, beautiful response with the multi jab on his shield. He got pushed back far enough to the point where F Smash would still connect. So really great awareness on how much end life Greninja has out of the jab. Let's take another short off down air coming out from Stocksaker. Ooh, Greninja. I mean, Venia thinking Stocksaker would land past him. Whipping that dash a second right now. 71%. I love the fact that he used a shuriken to stall his landing momentum ever so slightly. Just threw off all the Stocksaker's timing. Yeah, we definitely have seen, we've seen Venya have been doing that a couple of times. Yep. Now yeah, he's just facing those spoilers. All he wants to do is knock Stock Taker off. Uh, that was good patience by Venya, not immediately descending with down here, because he knew that Stock Taker was going to yep. come up there with the up air. But he is going to get eaten by that, uh, explosive, by that flame. explosive flame. We could Falling. be seeing a potential game five on our hands here if uh, Stock Taker manages to take this stock away. Mm. Okay, now, many are doing a great job of this dash attack. Uh, but uh, Stock Taker able to whip punish it really, really well. Both of them just scrambled near each other at close range. That was very, very frightening. Gonna parry that forward air. Oh, he's gonna catch him in the air with that. Oh, wow. yeah! And we're taking it to game five. Wow. <laughs> stock Taker, I mean, in this game, he was completely different. It wasn't even close. He was up two stocks, only at 50%. Yeah. 
and it's unbelievable that the last five sets we've had with all Game 5. <laughs> I was about to say, I think we've seen so many Game 5s, I've lost count. Yeah. I mean, this is this has just been one heck of a night, man. Anyhow, oof. This is really, really tense. Opting for FD. This, I think, is a much better stage for Greninja than it would be for Palutena because he's able to get just, like, so many great tech chases here. Yeah. I mean, sure, he can't get any platform combos. Yep. But I think just having a nice flat stage should be yep. to do wonders for uh, Benya. And right there, like, his dash attack and his down tilt on the stage with no platforms will just have so much more utility trying to get a two frame with down tilt, but unfortunately not connecting it. I love that recovery from Stock Taker, effectively subverting all of the uh, options that uh, Venya could throw out at that given moment. And the first hit of back here, interrupting Stock Taker's get up option and sinking him back down, but he's able to get back up and reassert stage control. Got a dash attack, man. He's going to air down the forward air. But Stock Taker gets a dash attack up his own, parries the back air, Ooh. down tilt the forward air, not going to steal the stock just yet. Stock Taker at 123%, but that forward air will take the stock from And Venya Stock Taker. only taking 35% on that first stock, so right now Stock Taker is definitely going to need to string along the damage. Venya is at that percentage where Palutena doesn't necessarily have amazing conversions, so meaning he might be staying at it for quite a long time. That was beautiful. He knew Stock Taker was going to land aggressively and was able to punish him quotingly. Just shield that explosive flame. Really great burst option with the dash attack. Super, super safe. Just catching all of Venia's landings. Three times, three times already. Lovely back here. Just kept calling out the fact that Stock Taker was going to go above the ledge. Look at the dash attack there. Jumping over that explosive flame, but and unfortunately, he not ran into a nail. to take it quite yet. And the nail still scooping him up, but not enough to kill at this given moment in time. Stock Taker is waiting. Stock Taker is really, really patient. I can't get that up smash, but he unfortunately hair right in front read. of him. Wow. <laughs> and Venge is definitely feeling himself now, taunting right after he took that KO. Game five, still sitting at three stocks to one. Oh my god, Stock Taker needs to take the stock right now before Venya even thinks about getting anything started. You see Venya walking up aggressively. Ah, and there you go. He All was right. charging There's up a start the right there. There is he, a start right there. He was a little bit he was a little bit overzealous. He was a little bit too excited with that one. Ooh, trying to get the parry punish F smash. See Stock Taker hovering above the stage like that. Maybe wanting to go for the down air, but deciding not to commit to it. All right now, you see actually Venia being the one struggling to take Stock Taker, uh, to hit Stock Taker. He, maybe he doesn't want to commit to anything too aggressive. No, probably not. He's going to get a grab. Raw back is going to miss. And now Stock Taker is just playing patiently. He doesn't want to go in for any aggressive options himself. Really, really great dash attack. Ooh. Ooh. That, that was interesting. He just that drifted. whiff box looked a little scary there. All right, he's gonna just interrupt that. Oh, but he's gonna get that O smash. Both the shield pressure. Yep. He's, he's just got him in his face and the down tilt. And down tilt and that will do it. Super and solid. He reversed to out. Uh, like reversed to stop them. Yeah, and now uh, Vendia. Really? Vendia will be moving on to grand finals. No, we will not be. We will be moving on to losers semis, and then we'll have losers finals, and then we will have grand finals as that was winning.